Hey guys, welcome back to Tsori's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to remove text from video without blur in CupCut. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. So if you're wondering how do you actually remove a text from a video in CupCut? Well, the direct answer to that is right now with CupCut, there's no direct way for us to remove text. So the best thing that we could do here is just basically use a third-party software or a software that we will be using to remove sex. So in this case, that's going to be Snap Edit. So go to Google Play and just type in Snap Edit here and just press on Snap Edit and install it into your mobile device. Now, this one is pretty easy. Just go ahead and install it. It's actually free. Now, once you've installed it, you want to go ahead and go to CupCut, locate the project that you want to basically edit. So in this case, I'll be creating a new project here and I'll be adding my assets and just click on add. And from here, you've started creating your project and whatnot. But let me just select the correct photo here. Now in here, the next thing you want to do is you want to go back into your home screen and look for snap edit and basically open it up. Now, in this case, since we want to basically clear or remove a text, this is the home screen for Snap Edit. So we want to click on Start Remove Objects, and we want to select the object that we want to basically remove the text on. So in this case, we want to select this one, and it's going to give you ads, so make sure to wait for the ads to complete. Now, in here, what you need to do is you want to choose the brush option here, and you want to brush over the text that you want to remove. So since we want to remove this one, we want to brush over the whole text and once you brush on it just click on the remove button that you see at the very bottom then it's going to start removing that text so this might take a few seconds or a minute for it to complete but once it completes the save option at the top right should be available to you so let's just wait for this one now here just click on save at the top right and you want to choose high quality now from here add again make sure to complete it and wait for it now, as you can see, it now says image saved. So we want to close this one and we want to go back into CupCut. Now, from here, what we need to do is we want to start adding our object here. So go to the lower side here and you want to look for the section that says overlay. So just click on it and you want to add overlay. Now, from here, you want to choose the asset that we just recently moved the text on and just click on add. And from here, you want to resize this one, so make sure that it fits your whole screen. Now, from here, what we need to do is select that specific object that we want to use. So this one is the very front. And we want to scroll at the very bottom here and choose the option that says Mask. Now, since we're choosing Mask, we're only selecting a portion of it. So in this case, we want to choose Circle, or you could use another one if you want as well. Now, from here, you want to resize your circle until the text is covered and you've just successfully removed a text from your project here. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.